You can't get inside the mind of a dead girl, Isabel. Liz confronted me last night. She thinks I'm a murderer. Since I started the show already, by the time I was ready to like explore the other one, I actually stopped myself and wanted to play my own version of Maria and not have that outside influence. I just wanted to do what was on the page for me and my interpretation of it. And especially because on the first one, they're in high school. And this one is, is aged up. It's completely different. I mean, she owns a bar. She's very, very adult. And I just wanted to play her with whatever came to my own imagination right now. I've never been a bartender, but what I'm noticing thing about Maria is it's not just about serving the drinks it's actually about controlling the atmosphere of the bar she has a responsibility in the bar to make sure everybody's getting along that there's no riffraff that she's not over serving anybody but she's also like eavesdropping on the gossip a little bit so I think she loves having her spot be the place that people in town come to let loose I absolutely believe that there's other life forms in the universe. I think it would be a little close-minded to think in this great large galaxy that we're the only speck of dust that is moving and alive. So um, aliens is something I've been interested in for years since way before this show came along. I've been a fan of ancient aliens and George Nori. Um, Bashar, um, that's a weird one if you <laughs> if you want to look him up. And um, so getting on a show about aliens is just a subject that I never get tired of. I think it's there's so much more to be explored and exposed. And hopefully in our lifetime, we'll see more of that. I have seen a light in the sky over, actually we're in Pasadena right now, and it was on a drive home from Pasadena about a year and a half ago. And it was some very strange blue light that just came through the sky and then stopped. And it, was, it didn't dissipate and it didn't move. And I was with my sister and my sister-in-law. It was very weird. And then the next day, there was something in the news about a rocket launch from Phoenix that had gone a little bit wrong and they hadn't notified anyone about it. And the whole thing was a little strange to me, if I can say so. After high school, you would have followed me. Anywhere. <laughs>